Mark Milligan, you're not for sale. Stay put. Do your team a favour. Now, it looks like, and we're just inferring things here and we're just drawing out assumptions that look credible and it seems to be the case, but his agent wants the move, which tells me that most likely Mark Milligan wants the move over to the Middle East. If that's the case, I think that's rubbish. This is an experienced soccer that I truly believe should stay put in the A-League until the end of his contract, see it out. I applaud Melbourne Victory for digging their heels in. Now, was I happy with Melbourne Victory blocking his move to Crystal Palace? No, I wasn't. I wanted to see him test himself. But I'm sorry, I think the club have got this one right. You cannot let such a valuable asset leave. And I said it yesterday on the podcast. This guy is one of the best players in the A-League, period. This guy can catapult Melbourne Victory to a title tilt. Yes, a title tilt. Melbourne Victory still have enough quality in their squad to do damage in the finals. If anyone out there thinks that's not the case, well, you don't know your A-League because it certainly is. That's why I think well done to Melbourne Victory for saying, sorry, Millsy, you're not going anywhere, right? And I think for Millsy, and I've heard a few things, there's a few murmurs coming out of Melbourne Victory and, you know, I do have my sources that, yes, he does have his differences with certain players. I think everyone out there that follows the A-League intimately knows which player that I'm speaking about. So we won't go into too much detail about that. Get over your differences. Put it to the side. Get to training. You don't have to be best mates, right? That's football. And I've, I've, I've played at different levels. Obviously played for Essendon United back in the day. A bit of a piss take there. But in all seriousness, Millsy, get over those differences. Train hard. Try and win your side a championship. And don't put the fans offside because the fans bloody love you because you are such an industrious player on the pitch. You're a leader as well. And that experience is going to be invaluable heading into finals. Stay put. Not only that, don't take the cheap option. Australian football fans don't like it when they see our own local players heading over to the Middle East and it's a cop-out. Again, stay put. Think about it from their perspective as well. Look at it in terms of your PR. And it's not a good move because you can be the main man in this league in your position. You can dominate in this position. For the last 10 games of the league, you can try your hardest to get Melbourne victory into a position to win yet another trophy at this illustrious football club. It seems like a better fit for me, for your Russia uh, credentials, so to speak. So stay put, work your ass off, and don't go and play in the desert.